Samus, man. He has to have two different tags for these characters. I think because he plays Vito on uh, Pikachu, it doesn't play Vito on Samus. My so. man got that button mix up. But yes, here we go. E-Sam whipping out the Samus again. Served him well against Supergirl Kells in that run back at Montreal. We'll see if it'll be enough against Raph. Samus that character, like, really weird to, like, play Samus because I feel like Samus, uh, you know, potentially has been seen as a bad character for a long time. But as of late, has been doing some, uh, had some pretty good results. And, and, you know, people are starting to find the real strength in her. Yeah, and so I, it's kind of crazy. So I feel like she just, you know, maybe she's like a, a mid here now, possibly. I've always thought that Samus just, I don't, like, she was just never in the position where people tried to make her seem, you know what I mean? I, I've seen Icy Miz do some wonderful things with Samus before. Remember, even at Super Smash Con, like, she beat uh, Elegant yeah. with Samus. So, like, I've always thought, like, Samus has some potential, man. And, and we've seen Isam before defeat Ally with this character back at Civil War. I mean, there's a lot of hidden accolades that people don't really give Samus enough credit for. Yeah. She can do some things. All right, not doing too much right now. The Raph is in firm control, that is for sure. About a 60% lead. The ECM looking to chip back in two right now. All right, I'll give you one thing, man. Sam is definitely about to become Dash Tag Simulator when it comes down to it. Oh, that's what we need. That, that, Dash Tag is, is, is her, her everything, man. Her bread and butter. She has to throw them joints out. There it is. All right, quick. Try to get that neutral area in there, but going to get scoped out real quick by, uh, by Raph. Dancing on him. Hold up. Just a little bit. Make sure you got served down here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Actually gets hit with the spring, trying to come off the ledge too early. The spring's going to go ahead and uh, stay spike on butt. Oh, oh wow. Okay. I'm saying, bro. I thought that might have been it. Yeah, yeah. Down there, not able to connect. Raph going to hold this lead for now. Oh, I like the grab. Mm. All right, charging it up just a little bit. One shot. One kill. That's all he needs, so I'll be honest, man. If he gets a good uh, charge shot right here somewhere, uh, you know, a good part of this stage, he should be able to get this stock off, but got to charge it up. Looking for the F smash, too. Samus also has a strong back air. Looking for a double down air. Damn, okay. Trying to send a message or something. F smash also kind of deceptively strong, especially at this with a little bit of rage on it. I feel that. Looking for the, uh, I actually try to get him with the cross the back air, but not going to get it. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Anybody else, I think, would have got hit by that. Escape but, you know, plan man, Sonic B. is out. Man, Sonic wasn't having any of that. Wrath with a tremendous lead. Okay. Yeah, yeah there yeah. it is. Good nice follow neutral layer. Yeah, seriously, great follow-through from Esam. Pretty relentless on that chase down off stage. It pays off for him, but he is at 101%. Uh, that, this is uh, one thing that, well, I don't, I don't even know. I think that might actually be character dependent. So, you know, don't quote me on these Samuses, but well, actually, I'm just going to ask the Samus in the chat. Can he get si Shine Sparked? I need to know. I need to know. Some Samus in the chat is going to be like, oh, yeah, only at, only at like 27%. He's already passed it. <laughs> He's already passed it. All right, excellent control thus far from Wrath. Samus' best efforts, or excuse me, Esam's best efforts falling a little bit short so far, but uh -oh. I don't know, got him at 55, maybe some opportunity knocking. All right. Yeah, I mean, he's kind of bringing it back. Yeah. Rage could potentially be on his side. He hasn't got any charge shots yet, but, you know, Samus still has Ooh. a very... Oh, hold up. At the edge? It'll be all right. It'll still be living. Right. That's a heavy character. You got all that armor on. You better do something with it. A little floaty, but definitely heavy. All right, Raph. Trying to seal this one away. Oh! That should yeah. be the confirmed. Nice. Yeah, that'll do it. Okay. Originally thought he was going to try to go for the neutral air, pop him off the top, but the forward air definitely worked. I like the DI coming in from uh from East Ham. It looked, like he, looked like he DI'd farther in and then tried to DI up into the corner, but, you know, it was very close to living that. Yeah. All right. So, Wrath able to get that dub. You know, I, I know um, – I, I don't remember what tournament it was, but we were listing some of those accolades of Icy. I think Icy also beat Wrath too. So, I know Wrath, you know, in the past – Obviously, he's had, you know, some trouble with uh, Samus. But on that one, man, you know, he would just kind of overcome Isam. Obviously, Isam is going to play a little bit different. But Okay. Well, from, uh, according to the chat and Isam, no, she cannot uh, shine spark uh, Sonic. So. Oh, it's Icy in the chat? Yeah, yeah, yeah man. Shout out to Icy, man. Yeah. Holding it Hold down. Holding it down. <laughs> Black play. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> we here. So, yeah, uh, yeah, man, it's going to be game two. Uh, Wrath. You know, he actually was in, in firm control for uh, quite a bit, but Isam did kind of threaten that that uh, game, almost almost able to take it away if he was able to land a, a you know, plus charge shot with the amount of rage that he had. But luckily for Raph, he was able to yeah. find that last spin dash in the forward air. Okay, looking that grab. That's going to be a clean, easy opening for Raph. Uh-oh. Mm, 
Okay, where are you going, though? Yeah, a lot of control on this right side. Hold that up, B. Yeah, he's gonna, gonna be able to drift back to the stage. I mean, I saw what he was going for. Just trying to see if he can get some damage uh, while Raph was out there. A little yep. off the mark. Well, actually, kind of way off the mark. I ain't gonna say a little. <laughs> you gotta keep it real, man. My man. Keep sometimes it a buck. You just <laughs> <laughs> sometimes you just across the stage. Uh, yeah, a little <laughs> off the mark, nah, bro. All right. So Raph, once again, firm control of this game. A little, a little bit of a lead here. So I won't say he's like, you know, won't say he's he's not threatened, but definitely keeping the lead on his side. Scooped up, down throw. Like it's a little too late for him to get anything off that though. All right, great positioning for Wrath. Like the coverage from Esam though. Yeah. One. Oh, okay. That was slick. Yeah, that was super slick. I mean, I feel like he's been coming out, trying to do uh, come off the ledge with neutral air a lot. Yeah. So they had a little mix up of multi hit moves. I oh, mean, Wrath probably felt a shield get touched and immediately dropped the shield. Oh, damage on the shield too, man. You better watch out. Four throw. DI mix up right there. Between the fourth throw and the up throw. Can die to both. Which one he's gonna go for this time? Up throw. Very close. Oh, alright. This was looking pretty grim for Isan at the start of it, but I credit him a lot for bringing this one all the way yeah. back. But speaking of backs, that is a back throw, and that is gonna be a lead for Wrath. Damn. I'm, I, I feel like. So that's, that's an old school sonic technique of putting the spring under someone as they come back so that way uh, they get bounced into the sky and, uh, and uh, you know, don't get a chance to use their invincibility. But, like, I feel like Ethan saw that and just didn't care. Either that, oh, Lilat. No. <laughs> <laughs> Lilat. Doesn't matter. I don't think he would have died to it. But still, man, my man just slid across the ground. He's oh going to be off with that. God. I like that. Bruh, the turnaround reversal of fortunes on that exchange. Two can play with that spring, man. Oh, man. Okay. I don't know if he jumped yet. Yeah, here you go. Save the jump. Still might. Probably going to be able to make it back with Tether anyway. Or bomb, uh, you know, bomb recovery. All right. Isan, man. Just rough outing in this top eight right now, by the way. Just you know, didn't have a, a really good time against uh, Tweak, and now he's not. Doesn't look like he's having a greater time against uh, Wrath either. Yeah, Wrath is just not playing around. I mean, he's been just so uh, precise with all of his movements. Really good option selection. And Isam, I mean, to his credit, he's been keeping up, but he hasn't really been in a position where he can deliver that final blow. Yeah. See him, see him searching for that up beat. Yeah, yeah, Wrath is just so elusive. Just always right outside of uh, hit, Isam's hitbox on that up air, so. Either way, Isam finding the land a uh -oh. charge shot here. Oh, try to scoop up. Yeah, but just like that, Isam ah! is in this. Gives up the air dodge, though. Tough situation to find yourself in, but credits to Raph for the capitalization. Yeah, yeah. That'll be the 2-0 lead. A really late air dodge, too, from Isam. I mean, I feel like that, that air dodge so late, he should have been able to jump out by that time, but oh well. All right, Raph holding it down, man. I, honestly, I don't feel like I've ever really seen Raph smile. Yeah, like, well, <laughs> I mean, he smiled at the, at, during that pop-off, but usually yeah, I don't Yeah, but I'm really saying, like, usually, like, he's usually just, you know, stone-faced. But this man's having a good time. I mean, you know what? Why not? You about the only good thing Atlanta has as far as sports going. The yeah. Hawks are terrible. Yeah, okay, yeah. the Falcons just lost to the Cowboys. Okay, turn your heads to eSports, Atlanta. Okay, because this is who you need to be rooting for. Yeah, man, can we, get, can we get a tailgate for this? Damn, wow. man. All right. So Esam going to swap over to the Pikachu, man. Last hope here in this top eight. He has to get a win here. Otherwise, well, you know, enjoy that fifth place, man. See you. Still a good, I mean, still a good finish regardless, but, you know, you know he wants a little higher than that. Right? All right. Fights his way down. F smash on the other side. Wrath back trying to get out of there with the spring, but it seems like he was uh, scouted out. A little bit. I'm glad to see the Pikachu make an appearance, though. Yeah. You know, it was a good effort with the Samus. No doubt about that, but... You know, when your back's to the wall, man, you know who to call. Your main, man. Always got to do it. Especially in a three out of five set, man, you got a little time to mess around. So you, you could have even tried the Pikachu in the second game. It was like, oh, this ain't working. Let me go back to the same. Definitely. Instead, last resort's the Pikachu. Hopefully this last resort uh, Pikachu is what he needs to at least get a game here. Do oh! oh bruh, okay. Bruh. I was going to say it's looking good on the damage, but it didn't matter. Wrath said, oh, I see an opening, the up smash. He was like, oh, oh where are you going? Yeah, that way. <laughs> Straight okay. up. That yeah, was That was gross. Amigos gameplay right there. That Yo. Was, that was. Had that nice drip. All right. 
fragile lead, but a lead nonetheless for Raph, looking to close it out against PG's finest. Hey, moving through once again. Got to find a way to get the stock off, man. Raph's defense looking just phenomenal right now. Oh, okay. I love what he did with the spring. Marsed up in the movement, too, man. Just putting himself in uh -oh. situations to succeed. ECM's got to be careful. I'll throw. Whoa. I mean, look, right there, that right there was probably a reverse uh, thunder that he just messed up. Esam, uh, not sure what's going on. I know you just got engaged, but you, you're supposed to have a, a wedding nerves here in the game, dog. <laughs> like, this is, this is looking a little rough from him. Looking a little rough. Uh-oh. It's input all day, every day. All right. So now down to the wire for uh, for Ethan's last stock, man. I mean, that's 62%. He's got to watch himself. Okay, both of them guys missing grabs, so he's going to go ahead and reset the situation. I hear one more stock chance, man. Oh, yeah. The South is alive here. 71% on the Ethan. Oh. Okay, come on. Didn't, I think he was looking for the air dodge. He seemed to, uh, opted not to give it up. However, he almost got hit in the same situation on the right side, on the left. So, Rath finally losing that stock. 79% he's added on the ESAM second, though. It took forever. Yeah. But finally, he gets it done. But, I mean, this you know, it's just an incredible play thus far for Rath. Take quite the effort from ESAM to catch up right now. Okay. Running in on him. He almost got uh, Pikachu or. <laughs> Or uh, he's having one with his own setup. When he hits him with like one move, then rat, dash it up, try to get the jabs going. All right. Oh, yep. is it? Yes! There we go. Look at it. Look, looking like a little soldier boy, man. How appropriate just Superman that hoe. <laughs> you 